Hey folks, Dave the Not So Evil Evil Viking 13 here, and welcome back to the Witcher 3 Blood and Wine expansion pack here on my third episode of my playthrough. I'm here in the capital city, and we're going to take a quick break from the main quest to do some housekeeping and a bit of exploring and side questing because I want some of these new armors and abilities. First things first. My swords and my equipment probably need some repairing. They've been in rough shape for a while now. Man, this city is ridiculously detailed. Also, just the overall extravagance is just a huge contrast to everything in Velen. All of the war-torn Northern Realms. Eat, drink, and listen to serendipity. For you I'm are so into back. Vineyard owner. Master Witcher, what luck to happen upon you. Got work for me? New contract? Of the contract in question, you acquitted yourself beautifully years past on your last sojourn in Beauclair. I was in a bit of a bind at the time, do you remember? Yet I swore a solemn vow to pay you in full one day. Guess it rings a bell. Sadly, you went on your way before I could settle matters with you. So, I took your coin and placed it in an account for safekeeping. Hmm. What kind of account? A savings account at Chanfanelli Bank. You need but walk in and withdraw. The sum must be rather substantial by now. Hello. Thanks. Head over there first chance I get. I gotta stop Paper chase. Bank. Well, before we stop in at the armory, I'm going to the bank, guys. I am loving all of these fan service tie-ins to the novels. Come on, you quickly, After all, this oh. definitely is not Geralt's first trip through Toussaint. He's no hero. That's the butcher of Blaviken. Is the bank? They're open between eight and ten. Except during meals. Yes? Can I help you? Catch 22. Building secured by the Reitenbach system. It's a patented system. It has Demetrium amplifiers, stifling auras, and other mysterious no machinery that guarantees absolute security against all forms of magic attack. Including Witcher signs and spells. <laughs> Bruno Reitenbach and Company. With us, no one will get the jump on you. Well, good to know. I can't use any signs in here. Oh, hello. Welcome to Gianfinelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, and the customer's always right. How might I be of service? I'd like to change some coin. By all means. Hello. I had a lot of florins and orins on me. Got an account here. Like to make a withdrawal. Naturally. Your name? Geralt of Rivia. Wait a moment, please, while I find the relevant record. I'm afraid I can't help you. Extraordinary circumstances, you see. There's a note in the records. The account holder is dead. That's inaccurate, as you can see. It's some kind of mistake. The note is clearly an error. To reactivate the account, you'll need permit 838. For more information, please go to window number one. All right. 
Where's window number one? Oh no. Obtain A38 permit from window one. Guys, I'm on a DMV quest. Permit A38. Good luck with that. Onions. Always. Right. Are these dwarves just guards? All in order. Welcome to Chan Fanelli Bank. Guess so. There's a note here. Times are tough, coins tight, and to make matters worse, there are thieves ready to pounce. The bank has a solution to you. Safe deposit boxes. Oh, there's a catch. Window one. Catch 22. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc., etc. How can I help you, sir? I'd like to reactivate my account, so I need a copy of Permit A38. Wrong window, I fear. What do you mean, wrong window? I was told I'd get Permit A38 here. Please remain calm, sir, or you'll rupture a vein. <laughs> So just tell me where I get this stupid document. Perhaps upstairs, in records, or downstairs in the archive. You must ask them, sir. Do just that. <laughs> <laughs> Do I ask in records or in the archives? No safer place than a bank. <clears throat> These customers will not be served. <laughs> Looks like records is upstairs. What can I do for you? You cut the line, sir. <laughs> Bump, push, shove. It's uncivil. Sorry, got to get through. Hold there. What is this? Back off the queue, sir. <laughs> I broke the queue. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own. And the customer is always right. How might I help you? This where I get permit A38? Naturally. Just hand me your form 202, please. Oh, no. Form 202. All right. Where do I get that document? Allow me to explain. Permit A38 can only be issued upon presentation of Form 202, as stated specifically in Ordinance N60. Please, go to window number one. No. <sighs> Just came from there. Never mind. Be back shortly with Form 202. Jump into the queue! How dare you! You cut in front of me, sir. Brave man. Who would step in front of a man that looks like Geralt? Did no such thing. Been standing here the whole time. Is that so? You know you're the third today to try that ruse. I will not stand for this. Just you wait, I'll teach you some manners. <laughs> Go that on, hat. hit me. <laughs> oh, gentlemen, if you wish to raise a ruckus, do it outside. Outside, now! The man in the funny hat demands satisfaction. Oh, here we go again. Come on, I'm wearing armor. This is not fair. Check the door if you bear. They're right at the gate. It's the third time this week. I wager ah. ten on the one on the right. You cannot be. You what? Lost your nerve? I shall teach you a meaning of decency. Poor simpleton, prepare to be humbled. Oh, 
Come on, Geralt, land a punch. I shall take <laughs> mid sentence. He flicks me off. You cut the line, sir. That's right. You take your honor and proper line cues. Go back upstairs in shame. All right. Form 202. Come on. Where the hell she go? Hairball made. Need to follow the scent. Could be the lead I need. Come on. Where the hell she go? Hair bomb made. Need to follow the scent. Could be the lead I need. What can I do for you? <laughs> Welcome to Chan Fanelli Bank. Hmm. There's a catch. Yes? Can I help you? Catch 22. So you see, she claims puffed sleeves will be in fashion next season. Excuse me. Got something I gotta huh? take care of at window you one. cannot be serious. I too find it hard to believe. For Excuse me. Can you not see what it says there? We're on our break. <laughs> Celine, darling, sign this for me, will you? Oh, there you are. Listen, there's something We're I... on break. Ah, you try to be polite, it just never gets through. <laughs> Sit no and wait. Need to wait till they're done with their break. Can I help you? I was this is amazing. Up. Just sitting, when suddenly, knock knock, I opened the door, and who was there if not Lepiota's witnesses? I've heard of them. What did they want? Oh, they left me a stack of manuscripts about the prophet. I've not had time yet to look through them. No safer place than a bank. Amazing. Hmm. You must wait. They have a break now. <laughs> Where the customers always right. So, what do you hope to get here? Permit A38. Though, guess I need Form 202 as well now. Form 202? Easy peasy. Certificate P. Now, that is a challenge. But, as we are both forced to wait, fancy a round of Gwent. Yes! Redeemed! Quest worth it? Maximum coin? Why not? Let's lay him out. Now, that I understand. I'll start arranging my deck. Hmm. Oh, my friend, you have no idea how big my deck is. Oh, yeah. There's my spies. My cow. And I think that should do it. Now, let's add Letho in there too. Scoyatel. Is this new Gwent music? I've played like 40 hours of Gwent in this game. It's very strange to hear new music. Um, I'll skip the frost and the clear weather. There we go, a medic. Got two spies up front. He's going to double the front row. I do have Gwent set to hard difficulty. Oh, he's got a spy too, huh? I have a lock. Okay. He decoyed my spy. I'm going to keep rolling my spies. 
muster for him. I have 13 cards. He has... Just 10. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to throw the first round, guys. But before I do, I'm going to scorch that spy. Okay, he's going to medic it. I'm going to steal it. And here comes another spy. I'm going to play my spy again. Just give him all those free points. He's going to muster, although I do have a frost. Hmm. He would still have quite a few points if I played that frost, and I think I'm going to save that frost, yeah. I'm gonna pass for now. As I expected, he passed immediately. Looking at his discard pile. Let me use my leader ability to steal one of my spies back. Ooh, almost misclicked. Do a spy, okay. And a spy. And a free hero spy. Can you guys tell what Nilfgaard's specialty is? Now I've got a lot of medics, so I can play a good card and not worry about it. I'm going to play the cow, which gives me an 8 once this card leaves the board. So because he's passed, the end of this round basically. Now Nilfgaard wins ties. So with so many medics, well, with one medic, I'm going to play an actual 10 and win that tie. I do feel like the frost is not going to be useful this last round though. This is going to get nuts guys. We have tons of cards and this is the last round. He's going to Scorch the 8. Not bad. That was basically a free card, though. He's going to double his Archery Row. That means I can now play one of my 10s pretty safely from Scorches. And just to be a jerk, I'm going to play my 1 Medic first. And use that to get the 10. Take that one extra point. Yeah, he's going to go all in for that archery row, the ranged row. Um, I'm going to go all in on close combat. Yeah, he is doubling a lot of units right there, but these multipliers right here, these threes, should be the key to my victory. I'm pretty confident for that. He's all in on archery, and I'm still right behind him. 
Hmm, a rain, interesting. And he has passed. I'm already going to win, but this is the killing blow right here. Those threes multiply to nine, 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 and then I'm gonna double that entire row for 162 for my total. That's a lot of cards. Yeah, he went all in on that first round as I just kept playing spies. A seasoned player, I see. Congratulations. Hmm. As your prize, I shall reveal to you my foolproof method for cutting through this bureaucracy. Nothing ever comes of using the normal channels. I have seen them try everything. Magic, hypnosis, bribery. Nothing works. Might as well go if nothing works. There's nothing I can do. Be kind. Be pleasant. This and only this. The woman here, she sits at her window 12 hours each day without hearing so much as a good day from anyone. Well, he has a point. But muster up some flowers, some perfume. Well, you will resolve your matter lickety split. Right. Certainly worth a shot. I might already have flowers. Luck. <laughs> He's still just waiting. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc., etc. How can I help you, sir? Need Form 202 to get a copy of Permit A38. Do you know that? Couldn't have told me? Wasted a lot of time because of you. Please, sir. There's no need to lose your temper. I thought it obvious and thus needed no stating. The form will soon be ready. Name and surname? Geralt of Rivia. Let me find it. Get on, Gemel. Here it is. Geralt of Rivia. Sorry, sir, I cannot issue Form 202. Excuse me? The applicant in question has been declared dead. Officially. Now, do tell me, sir, how am I to enter that into the ledger? Got you some flowers. Just to thank you for helping me with my file. Oh, but I... I shouldn't. For me? <laughs> really? Match the color of your eyes. Oh, fine. You, sir, are quite the charmer. Ah, please, wait a moment. I shall fetch Master Cinfanelli. Perhaps he'll arrange something that excludes the paperwork. That's right, Geralt, you and that beard are going places. Charm your way in. Uh, you tell him, Danny Disturb, but no, always some bugger who can't stand to wait. Plow me, who's this? Hearty greetings, Master Geralt. You haven't paid us a visit in eons. Been a bit busy, <laughs> but I'm back now and I need your help with something. Of course. Now, do tell, how can I help you? Got a problem with my account. Wanted to withdraw some coins, see, but... Nay, nee problem there. We'll get you paid up in a jiffy. I'm just gonna need to settle yon tiny wee trifle. Heard that already. Permit A38, among others. Oh, my hands are tied without them, Geralt. But I see you're a quick learner in the ways of banking. You'll get them in a heartbeat. Chanfinelli, no more excuses. Pay out my coin, now. Come on, Master Witcher, for why the ire? There's no need. We'll have it all for you. You just need to see the necessary documents. Got a document right here means a hell of a lot more than any of your forms or permits. Have a look. Her enlightened highness, 
She hired you. Ooh. Mm -hmm. And as her personal emissary, I demand access to my account right now. Uh, uh, aye, Master Witcher. This way. So how's the trade these days, Master Witcher? Can't complain. Good for you, because in our neck of the woods, things are dark, dark shite. Wine sales are stuck in the muck and sinking deeper. It's the fucking wretched names, I tell you. Oh. Folk out with the duchy have me any notion how to say Cote de Blessure oh, and all that. It twists their tongues in bloody knots. Makes them ashamed to ask for it. Order. Done. Deposit box 256. Last gin on the right. Finally, my coin. Geralt's back from the dead and it's payday. What the hell's this, Chenfinelli? Box is empty. Well, uh, coins got to circulate. So when we learned you were dead, Master, we, uh, circulated yours. Purchased stocks, bonds, invested in a few vineyards. Before we knew it, there was hee-haw left in the box. Really ought to call it what it is. You robbed me, plain and simple. Nay, Master Witcher, never! I wouldn't dare! Oh, you'd dare. And now you'll answer for it. Open the gate. Master Witcher, I'll pay it all back, every red copper. I swear it on my nana's beard. Hmm, you're a bank. You better be good for it. Got a week, not one day more. You shan't regret this, I swear. I'll rustle it up. Have it ready for you in seven days. Mm-hmm. See you then. Man, how much money am I gonna get out of this? It better be good. The North must Dirty gold chasing dwarves. Alright, so now we wait a week and go back to the bank and wow it is 7 p.m. guys in game that is hopefully we can still get over here to the armorers before they actually close because I still want to go chase uh, the paperwork of that uh, I think it was a sorcerer who worked on Witcher mutations first I need my swords repaired. The best armor around! That is what I forge! Ah, so sorry. Hmm, what have you got there? Okay, what do you got there? Anything new? I'm seeing lots of classic armor. Whoa. You can get horse armor. With 90 stamina. Toussaint saddle. I'm liking this blue one right here. I think I'll take it. And for blinders, they have some aggressive looking ones. This one's almost wolf style. I'll take it. I'm gonna sell this extra pair of armor that I have. Actually, no, I'm gonna put that in storage. That's actually really good armor. What on earth? Better saddlebags, too. Guys, that bank needs to come through because this DLC is going to be expensive. Parchment junk.
Now the armor that I found so far looks to be color guardsman armor. Everything but the top. They do have knight's tourney armor. That's 2,000. It has no extra uh, glyph slots at all. But it looks awesome and it's significantly better than what I have. Mmm. You know what, guys? I'm gonna play the part. I've got 22,000 crowns right now. Let's grab some of that tourney armor. Do they have the pants to go with it? Yes, they actually do. And it is heavy armor, but I haven't really tried a whole lot of heavy armor before. So Geralt is going to get himself some... Oh, not golden trousers. Those are 5,500. Yeah, we'll go with these. Much more reasonable price-wise. An 851 for some boots. And I'll keep the leather gauntlets, I think. Mm. Now, let's go all in for the armor. Whew, that was expensive. Repair all of my equipped armors. And for the last stage here, let's sell some of our junk. Oh, not dismantle. Sell. Will he actually buy junk? Okay. Not here, he won't. And I'll do you so, guys a favor and not play every single merchant in Gwent just yet, but move on from here. Ooh. And this should be the blacksmith. I love all the detail, even on the shop signs. Just awesome. Ooh. This is fancy. <laughs> Just gather some ingredients from his decorative plants here. This place feels expensive. That golden light coming in the windows. The best steel in all of Tusa. Take a gander. Show me what you have. I brought two of my favorite swords with me, but I'll see what he has. Okay. Nothing mind-blowing, but mm, the Warhammer. I actually haven't tried one of those before. For a thousand crowns, is it worth the trial? Well, you know, I'm going to be wearing some heavy armor. Let's really play the part. Let's go all in. Okay. I think he's already good to go as far as repairs go. Farewell. No, see you later. Oh, okay. Aggressive, isn't he? Oh, wait, crossbows. I still have this Ophiri crossbow. Best steel in Do you sell crossbows? Show me what you have. Hmm, guess not. I saw one on the wall and thought I would check. Farewell. No, see you later. Let's go out in the plaza and check out our new armor. <coughs> Criminy, a worrying cough. 
Oh yeah, we have the new ability in the inventory to actually spin around and check out new loot that we find. So let's put on our gauntlets. Not those pants. Uh, where did the armor go? There it is. That's pretty legit. Hmm. Got the boots in all two. Gloves. Quinn, sign intensity. Pants that add vitality. So I'll do Ard for the pants. Just a 2% boost. And there it is. Some knight errant armor for Geralt of Rivia. And this is actually my first heavy armor. Let's get that hammer equipped too. Try something new. Yeah, that looks legit. Oh, and where's our saddlebags? How do you look, Roach? Ooh. Sleep strengthens. You look you aggressive. I like it. It's a very fancy saddlebag, though. None of which are suitable to show myself. Well, let's check out our quest list. Wine Wars, Belgard. Gwen's gonna happen soon, but I'm thinking, yes, we're going to investigate the Witcher mutations first. Night, love, and wine comes While you're here, Roach. Nilf Guardian Embassy. This is a Nilfgaardian province. The city itself is just beautiful. Oh, I feel sorry for the guards down here. With the drowners right next door. These level 35 drowners? They are. Wow, they hit hard. I do miss the slow motion for the sign changing. Monster liver. Oh wow, okay, UI is going off, guys. Look at that sunset. This game is gorgeous. This is like a fairy tale land. Mine is the horrible monsters <laughs> right outside of the gate. Oh, and this poor fellow right here. Sodden letter. Letter is soaked through and falling apart. Bruce, don't do anything stupid. I know you buried Selena at the Berclair Cemetery along with the rest of the loot from our last heist. Remember, we deserve a cut of that too, so don't be an idiot. We all know you were her lover, but remember she was also the leader of our gang. And that's what really counts. 
We never got our share for knocking over that jeweler. So burying Selena with all the loot is pure jackassery. <laughs> that treasure belongs to us all. Let's meet up and split things. And then you can drown yourself in the lake or hang yourself from any branch that you choose. Signed, Robin. Well, time to sidetrack from the sidetrack because there is treasure at stake. Find the treasure hidden in the cemetery. Oh, this cemetery. Oh! Greetings! Suspiciously loud for a cemetery at night. What is going on here? Strange. Can't hear anything now. Yeah, I definitely heard screaming. <laughs> Got a grieving woman. Oh, oh. lovely trifles. Yeah. Tracks. Tracks. Why is no one else concerned about the screaming? Got a statue. Hmm, an open grave. Graves dug up. Thing is, grave robbers don't usually wail and moan that much. Hmm. The crypts are locked, that makes sense. is coming from the catacombs it seems so noise is coming from here not a soul strange doesn't look anything like a grave hag's lair either yeah this is relatively well kept Margot de Quarantin. Smashed as if someone threw it against the wall. Louis de Quarantin died on the day of Saint Zoetham's remembrance. Pretty fresh. Funeral wasn't too long ago. So fresh flowers. Hmm. Gold. Can't be grave robbers. None worth their salt would have left this. No sign of monsters or grave robbers. Bit of a mess, that's all. Maybe this isn't the spot after all. Strange. Ah! Noise is clearly coming from that tomb. Impossible. Yeah, what is going on down here? I hear crying too, perfect. Perfect, grave robbers. Let's get him with Ard. 
try this Warhammer. Oh, nice. turns out. Let's give him a dancing star. That's right. Suffer. <laughs> Geralt fights with his Warhammer like it's a sword. Est Est. What is that? Ow. Well, I need to meditate and get my loot back. Both potions and bombs, anyway. Just for one hour, though. Do some alchemy prep. Is that a cat? Yep. Orders from Robin. No, honey croissant. That fool, flatulence fluffer Bruce, has tried to cheat us again. But he won't get away with it this time. Take a pickaxe and shovel, and pay our dearly departed boss a visit. Her kitty face was hideous to look at, even when she was alive, so the very thought of looking at it now gives me the bloody runs. Take the jewels, the pearls, and other valuables that uh, bum-nibbling Bruce tossed into her grave. And if you see the milk sop hanging around the cemetery, break his neck. Robin. Apparently, ever since Selena's death, that kid's been moping near Ulfimer Cemetery, howling at the moon. If I know life, and I do, he's got with him the key to the chest that we buried with the bitch. Perhaps we could end his suffering by ending his miserable life in the lake, if he hasn't drowned himself already, that is. Their little gang is definitely falling apart. The cat appears to have no interest in me. Guardsman trousers. Ooh. Three swords. Uh, all of them worse than mine, but all of them pretty valuable. The last exploits of Selena's gang. Quest completed. Oh, hello. We've got jewelry and some very valuable crafting supplies. Diagram to Sant Steel Sword. What does his journal say? This is the journal of a gardener. He's bored. He's thinking about going into a town to play some Gwent. He lost a month's wages on Gwent. Oh, no, next month's too. Racked up debts with Greybill Pellegrin. Heard he doesn't let such things slide. Gotta scrounge up a few florins somehow. And so a few days after that, he overhears the ambassador give instructions to his secretary. 
about a transport carrying wine for the Imperial Court, along with some unused operational wherewithal. <laughs> a sack stuffed with florins. Greybill slaughtered the caravan's guards, snatched all its cargo, and then had the gall to deliver a pouch of coin to me at the embassy. Said it was my share. I spit on his coin, but I'm afraid I'll need it soon enough. I hid what he gave me in a safe place. Ever since old Ralph died, no one buys wooden planters anymore, so his workshop is the perfect hiding spot. And it looks like from here on out, Greybill used him as a spy inside of the embassy. That is the uh, Nilfgaardian embassy. He stole the next convoy's route from the secretary's office. The transport set off. This time it's escorted by Arnold Ape Blum, commander of the embassy card. Greybill's men don't know what they're in for, a fight against elite soldiers. When he finds out, <laughs> it's time to get out of here. Coin I set aside should be enough to start afresh, somewhere far, far away. Journal kept by Quail, a gardener. So I have the diagram for a steel sword now. Let me just see what kind of sword that might be. Ooh. Required level 48 and exceptional damage. Pretty lightweight too. Well, I've got seven levels to go, but this DLC might be the one that pushes me to that point. I hope so, because I want to try that sword. I'm going to loot later. It really sounds like someone's in trouble, but it sounds like it's back at that same crypt. Yeah, positionally, it's coming from there somehow. Something's not right. Need to hide. See how things play out. Hide and find out what's making the noise. Reminds me of the Witcher 1 intro. The story of the Striga. You'd rather lie about all day. Flipping those cards like some, some dwarf! Disgusting! Indeed. Far better to stand at the door of Lepiota's temple, mumbling prayers from dawn till dusk. Ingrate, I prayed for you that you would cast off the yoke of gambling. Fine job you did of it. Seems the gods had also heard enough of your cackling. And you? Why are you here? This is a private conversation. <laughs> What's this argument about, anyway? Sort of. Not your concern. Could help you resolve it. I know not your name, but you must help me. I refuse to spend eternity at the side of this heathen. Remove him from my crypt at once! Slow down. What's the problem? This is my crypt, and this saintly shrew harangues me even in death. An eternity of nagging for misery! <laughs> I was blind and a fool to marry him. He's a slave to the cards, prepared to wager his own child on a round of Gwent. I know the feeling. Once, damn it, and as a jest. How many times must I explain? And... Who sank our fortune into some silly statue of Leviota? Piety. That was my cause. 
the prophet immortalized would have transformed this land of blasphemy and betting. How was I to know it was all a fraud? Because I warned you some 500 times? Quiet. Shut up, both of you. Who does the crypt belong to, rightfully? Must you ask? It's mine. My family's. The decorant towns. Are you illiterate? True. But my dowry served to repurchase it from those you owed. Hmm. Look, if there's to be peace and quiet here, one of you's gotta go. Need to move one of you out. Yes. Take him. Please. Do so. And I shall... I shall tell you where I hit his lucky Gwent cards. Oh. What? I knew it was you. And now you would evict me from my crypt, then pay for the deed with my cards. Blast it all. Had I those very cards at the tournament in Valhaven, I'd still be alive. It's your fault, you pox incarnate, that they stabbed me to death. <laughs> they murdered you for your debts. I had nothing to do with it. Come, I heed this good book-thumping wench. Mind, I know well where she hit those cards. I'll tell you myself, as soon as you've removed her. Need to think about it. All right, gotta move one of them out. Thus spake the prophet Lepiota. Thou shalt not play for coin. After which he promptly added, For you shall have none left for me. Heretic, shut your mouth. I shall speak to you no more. No, no, it is I who shall speak to you no more, you old tart. Insufferable. Ah, uh, hmm. Margaret and Lewis. I'm feeling more sympathy for Margaret because she was deceived by a religious fanatic, whereas Lewis was just gambling addict but she did apparently get him killed even if maybe her failures were a little bit more innocent in theory at least uh, when it comes down to it I know for sure that Margaret knows where she hid the cards so sorry Lewis but Louis de Quarantin, raise your size to the Prophet Lebiota on his behalf. And we're off with Louis's urn. I see you fell for that pious tart driven drat. Ah, oh, well, then listen, I've a request. Be a good fellow and set me in the chamber of the Gwent Friendship Society of Beauclair. It's just round the corner. You a member? That's just it. I was not. But I would have dearly liked to have been. And joining them in death shouldn't bother anyone. Certainly doesn't bother me. I'll do it. Where's this chamber? Ah. <sighs> Once you enter the catacombs, go straight. The chamber will be on your right, near the corridor's mouth, and I thank you. This feels like a trap. Is this like a cross hallway over here? 
some ore. Yeah, this place is huge. really do feel like this is going to be a trap. Private Chamber of the Right Honorable Members of the Gwent Friendship Society of Beauclair. May Private they always Chamber, draw their best. The Right Honorable Members of the Gwent Friendship Society of Beauclair. This is it. Wow, I really am stooping kind of low here, but... What's a little bit of grave robbing while on the job, right? Gotta pay for all these nice new things here in Tassant. Better to die of drink than of boredom. What is this? You gents also looking for that Gwent club? The poking devils! Who are you? Who sent you? So many questions, so few answers. Plank, <laughs> you're the plumbing philosopher. Get the smarmy cat diddler, lads! <sighs> if I only had a crown for every time a bunch like this. I like this Warhammer. That ought to do. That was a quick death for them at least. As the blood spills across the crates. Fiztech and Black Magic Doll. Bunch of weirdos. Ode to Gwent. Proposal number seven for the anthem of the Gwent Friendship Society of Beauclair. Gwent is like a ruddy wine. Gwent's a knight with a lady fine. When before you two armies clash, your cares melt off in a dash. Then you wish but to play, play, play. But her indoors wines hit the hay, hay, hay. <laughs> Such minds are dull as muddy yards. To think this but a game of cards. Chorus. Wow, this goes on for a while. <laughs> Gwent is my liberty. Gwent is my fraternity, Gwent relieves the day's sorrow, and Gwent is my morrow. They can holler and shout, they can release the guards, I'm leaving home, I'm off to play cards. That's amazing. Right, high time Margo paid up. Here. Have some candles. Ooh. Color guardsman's armor. Master level. I'm glad I noticed that. I'm going to duck down this hallway first. Fresh cart of food, okay.
What is back here? Oh, there's like a water channel back here. Armor repair kits. Some rune stones. Man, if I come out of these tombs and there's guards checking for grave robbers, I am screwed. That door is locked. That's right, all the way upstairs we go. Done. Now where you got those cards? Leaf the city through the Cooper's Gate, then via right. Our house is easily recognized. A tree atones the sign above the door. I buried the chest in the garden beneath the rose bush. Tree on a sign, rose bush. Think I got it. Might I ask what you did with Louis? True, he knew nothing in life but Gwent, but I would still prefer he not spend eternity in a ditch or privy. Don't worry about it. Found him a nice place. Ought to feel right at home. Farewell. <laughs> if only she knew. He left her. Lepiata's wounds. What was that? For the Gwent Hall of Friendship. Halt! Hook. Goes there. Well, what's your the business at the cemetery? I'm a witcher. Raids haunt your catacombs. Ah, uh, so it's true what old Lanzano said about the racket at the cemetery. I thought it grave robbers, perhaps, but wraiths? Have you? Ah. Huh? Took care of them. This Lanzano, think he might pay me for solving his problem? Oh, that's more than certain. Look for him at the clever clocks. Thanks. <laughs> there was a guard checking for grave robbers, but I guess the witcher's weapons convinced him that I was actually on the job, although I don't really have a witcher steel sword right now. I have the hammer. Even the stars here in Tassant are like fairy tale style. <clears throat> Hey guys, let's go find oh, this hidden stash of Gwent cards. Ow! I wonder how much of each of these in Texas. Rolling on an empty stomach. Oof, dreadful. Disperse! The exhibition of the Reginald Dobry Monument will remain closed until further notice. What closed? Silver Why, we wrote an Looking entire day to see it. You're a cheat, sir. And we paid good coin ah. for the tickets. Give it back! The oh. tickets oh. remain valid. You must merely wait patiently for the exhibition to One reopen. Claimed to be a medic, he ordered all who came to see him. Especially the hmm. to strip. Mm. We'll come back to this. Let's go get those Gwent cards. You'd best behave, Fred. You're in Beauclair, see? <gasps> that witcher's rather handsome. That's right, he is. This was a longer run than I expected. Search for a house with a tree-shaped crest outside the walls. 
medallion's humming. Something's not quite right. Oh boy. Oh. Arch four. I should probably draw my sword. Well, I was totally unprepared for this. Can I survive? Get Quinn back up. That was super close, guys. I was not expecting a fight. Got a few more dancing stars, it looks like. Nice. Fire damage does work. Die, you monstrosity. Under the rose bush. All right. Wow, that was extremely close. I had no health left. Was not expecting to fight a plant in the courtyard. What else is here? Guarding key. The car just walked by outside. Happy as could be. Is this the rose bush? Oh yeah. It's a whole rose bed. Just like she said. And the Gwent cards, as promised. The question is... Which cards did I get? I forgot my Gwent deck shortcut. Hmm. Maybe it's cards only for the Skellige faction that I haven't unlocked yet. Now we're to go find Charles Lanzeno at the Clever Clogs. Roach, where are you? Time is no cock. It keeps going. Oh, that's deep, I guess. For us trumpet. In the mood for fireworks and action? <laughs> Not with that hat. Come on, Roach. That's it, Roach. Let's go see what else is going on with this. Whoa there, Roach. Gwent addicted family. Faster. And could they possibly adopt me? Wow, 
I am glad that I brought Roach with me. That's quite the ride across town. I'm actually going to go ahead and sleep a bit until morning. Make sure that my contact is actually going to be here. There we go. Nothing doing. Sammy reeks around here. Ooh, you guys uh, playing some Gwent? Awesome, man. Oh man, the detail even in the signs is just awesome. This is a disgusting tavern. Oh, there's a puke bucket in the corner. Ah. There's drunks in every single corner. You walked into me. What's it? Noises at the cemetery. You the one they bother? Yes, yes, and I'm alone in that, it seems. That is, no one else has bothered to take any steps, though all must hear the racket. Took care of it. Truly? The howling's gone? For good? Wonderful! Ah, to sleep in my own bed again, at long last! But, but, what was it? Some ancient filth entombed deep in the catacombs. <laughs> yeah, really tough, demanding fight. Barely made it out alive. Is it your codex? Forbids you from revealing the details? For the best, I dare say. There's a small premium for you. That's right. It. Pay up. A uh, hundred crowns, not terrible. What's going on back here? Squeeze. Watch the water flee you be. A lot of Gwent, apparently. Yeah, this place is disgusting. Talk about a hive of scum and villainy. Alright, drunk. Either fall down ah. the stairs or get out of the way. Well, guys, I think that's gonna have to do it for our... Whoa! Ah. <laughs> Excuse me, m'lady. Uh, like I was gonna say before all these peasants started kicking down doors, I think that's gonna have to do it for our side questing for this episode. I'm going to have to go after those Witcher mutations some other time because it's time to get back onto the main quest and go meet up with Regis. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time. And our knights, what the hell? Chop liver? Please.